Right, I'm back from the parent-teacher meeting. Get down here pronto. Three hours I was at the place. The hall was freezing and not a cup of tea in sight. They need to limit it to three minutes maximum per desk. Some of the other parents are talking the ears off the teachers. Okay, so what did the teachers actually say about me? Your maths teacher said that you're doing okay. Well, that's good. Okay, Oshin. You should be top of that class. Uh, Mo, I'm just, I'm not that good at maths. You're just not applying yourself, Oshin. Oh. I spoke to Mr. O'Donovan and he says you're doing the bare minimum to get by. Well, I got a B at Christmas. Well, B or not, he's got you figured out, mister. You are coasting in there. You have so much potential. Brains to burn. You need to knuckle down. Laziness. Coasting, coasting, coasting. My Oshin could work for NASA. I don't want you sitting beside Barry anymore. Oh, no. You're sitting there, I can see you there now, tricking away. Now, I spoke to Mrs. Flynn, your business teacher, and she said you're working hard and you should be fine in the exams. To be honest, I don't think she knew who you were. Mom. Okay, you just don't believe any of the nice stuff and all the mean stuff. Mrs. Gotham says you need to apply yourself more. Yeah, now, she has it yeah, in for me. She problems. doesn't have it in for you. She does have it in for There's me. No she threw me out of the class three times last week. What? What did Mr. Garrity say? I don't rate him as a teacher. Yeah, Mum, what did he say about me? He's, he's not up to the task. What did he say? He's too laid back. Mum! I mean, he's trying to be friends with all the students. What did he say? Well, he said you're doing well. Mr. Doyle, the vice principal. Now, there is a man with a head for discipline. Yeah, Mum, he's a maniac. What did my art teacher say? Oh, I didn't go to her. What? Why not? The queue was a mile long. She just talks and talks. Ridiculous. What? That's my best subject. I saw that new English teacher of yours, Mrs. O'Neill. Lots of the fathers are very keen to speak to her, although I didn't think she was dressed appropriately at all. Your guidance counselor says that based on your marks from her assessment, that you should consider doing something with your hands, like carpentry or weaving. What? I actually got the smell of alcohol off her. Mr. Rooney wanted to know if you'd like to join the chess club, so I said you would. What? You'd like to join the debating club, I what? said you would. No! no. You'd like to join the choir, I said you would. Oh, Mom! Interested in Taekwondo, and I said no. Oh! I spoke to your music and drama teacher. What? Mom! And it had to be said to Oh, no, that. no! You should have no. been playing Mom. the role of Oliver Mom. in the school. You have a beautiful voice. That Shaffrey fella doesn't have a note in his head, and he's completely flat-footed. Doomed up! Hello, we're Foil Arms and Hog. Now, if you liked the video, like it and share it. It's the honest thing to do. You're it's telling it. them about your Vicar Street show. Yeah, they're, near, they're yeah. nearly sold Wait. out, so Wait. we're just giving them a... Oh, geez, so big thanks to everybody who bought all the tickets. Thank you very much. It's great. They're selling out, are they? Yeah, they are. Brilliant. Great. Great. I'm delighted for you now. <laughs> it do not. <gasps> she does have it in for There's me. No she threw me out of the class three times last week. What? <laughs> <laughs> That's great. That's great. <laughs> you have bollocks.